sentence has been annulled, but that doesn't mean the entire trial has been thrown out. Guatemala's constitutional court ruled that the expulsion of a defense attorney by a lower court didn't follow due process. The defense attorney appealed the ruling and the higher court issued a decision favorable to the defense on Monday. Essentially, this means that legal proceedings that happened after April 19th are invalid and must be repeated. Former Guatemalan dictator Efrain Rios Montt was sentenced to 80 years in prison after being convicted of genocide for ordering the deaths of almost 1,800 indigenous Guatemalans when he was in power for 16 months starting in 1982. But the guilty verdict was issued on May 10th and because of this ruling, his sentence has been reversed. Guatemalan human rights groups called the ruling a legal maneuver to protect the former dictator and an abuse in the interpretation of the law. The defense said that this ruling demonstrates that Rios Montt can still have hope in the Guatemalan judicial system. The trial is expected to resume in just a few days. Proceedings that occurred after April 19th will have to be repeated. Rios Montt, who's 86 years old, is currently in a military hospital. Guatemalan authorities must decide in the next few days whether he goes back to house arrest, as he was before, or to a state prison. Rafael Romo, CNN Atlanta.